Okay, we're going to take a look at some stuff going on in your videos. I think there's a misunderstanding going on with this whole slide thing. You know, I should probably have the last lesson up to... Hold on. Da -da -da. Okay. So, looking at this, I know I talked about... You want to think of sliding from this chord into this chord, but the idea is you pick this chord, slide into this, and as you have slid into this chord, that is when you pick again. But you are like, you're doing the, uh, the slide kind of in the wrong spot. So you're not sliding into this and then picking. I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. So at the slow speed, slow speeds is very apparent. At the faster speeds, it actually sounds the way it's supposed to. So let's take a listen here. Hi John, this is the video of my first lesson. Uh, we'll play uh, uh, starting at... Here we go. So the way you just did that right there, you went one, two, three, four, and you picked that A5 five times. It's only supposed to be four. This is how it's supposed to be. It's really slow. One, two, three, four, and then See, I slid my hand into the B5 and picked at that point. Really slow. Just A5 to the B5. That's how it's supposed to be. Not this. Mm -mm. Not that. We don't want that. That's not the goal. This is the goal. So let's continue on here. So that that's the issue. You are like picking the last chord. You're like, uh, so let's just, uh, I don't know how to think right now. So you hear that again. So um, I gotta kind of mixing up my counts right I'm now. now. I'm going to do 8300 and then start playing the repetitions. Okay, here we go. So yeah, the A5 was picked five times. Two, three, four. So, I mean, it's good that you picked the B5 four times, but you know, it's like, so yeah, it's just that whole like you're you're sliding at the wrong spot. So, so counting this. So one, two, three, four. One, two. So yeah, basically you're picking the the chord like like here. You didn't pick an A5 chord on beat 1 here. You still picked a B5. So when you go to change to this G5, you're not picking a G5 on the 1. You're still picking the A5. So hopefully this is making sense. You're not at the correct chord at the right point. So, again, like, the idea is you, you go into the new chord on beat one. You're just kind of moving your hand into it, and they got to collide at the same time. It's, it's just like clapping, but, you know, the, the left hand gets into that spot at the right time. The right hand gets into that spot at the right time. So they both have to, like, sync up at the same time, not pick and then slide really fast because you got to pick and then the left hand moves and then the right hand gets there. They got to end up at the same point. Yeah, 
I still... So at that speed, you're still hitting the slide in the wrong place. See, that point, it actually sounded good. Because now you've reached the speed that's so quick that it's actually made you start changing chords at the right point. on the transitions there. Let's skip to part two. So, so yeah, th that actually sounded good there because I think it's, it's going so fast that it's actually making you unable to do that slide the way that you were doing at the slow speeds and it's actually corrected how it's supposed to sound. Okay. So, what are we doing? I'm going to do this. So we're going to have uh, the half notes for everything. I want you to count 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 one two three four so when you say the word three you're going to move into that chord not one split second earlier when you say three then you move so we have the slides happening here and then we do the same chords again but you are going to pick on beat three as well as sliding your hand into that place. So, this is what we got. 60. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Hopefully all that makes sense. If you have any questions, let me know, and I'll see you in your next video.